Have you ever wondered what this custom shape tool is doing in the tools panel? In today's video I'll be showing you how to use the custom shape tool and what you can use it for. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So first of all, you can find the custom shape tool in the rectangle tool right here. And if you right click on it, you can see that in the bottom right here, there is the custom shape tool. If we try to press on this, this option right here will appear, named shape. If you press on this, you can choose some different things. You can choose leaf, trees, wild animals, boats and flowers. Let's say we want to add another boat to this image. Let's open this folder up right here. And let's choose a boat we would like. These options are silhouettes. So that means that they are illustrations you can use in your images. Let's say we want to use this boat right here. Select it and just drag it into your image. And make sure to hold down shift just like this. And you can scale this up. And just like that, we have now used the custom shape tool to create this boat right here. As you can see, there's these points right here. You can actually change the design. If you select the direct selection tool, you can select one of these points right here and you can actually change it. Just press yes. Let's say we want to customize this as we would like and just like this. You can also change the fill and the stroke. Let's say we want to make this a red one and remove the stroke. And you can also scale this up if you hold down Ctrl and T. You can now scale this up. You can add a lot of different illustrations to your photos. There is also leaves right here. And you can also get flowers and animals. And for these other folders, it is the same process. And when you're done creating your shape, you can now see that it has created a layer with the shape. And you can now name this layer as you would like. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video and comment down below if you want to see more videos like this. That was all for now. See you in the next one.